Good morning, humanity. It's July 19th, 2021, and it's our favorite time of the week because it's Mondays with Bev and Paul. And hi, everybody. My name's Paul. Hello, this is Bev. Good morning, Bev. Good morning to you. Good morning, morning to you. Paul. Back to you. <laughs> Hey, everybody. We're glad to see you on this Monday, and uh, it's a wonderful day out here in the desert. We've had nothing but uh, temperatures under the hundreds and rain every single day. That's Incredible. amazing. It is amazing, and it Love is it. so beautiful. Oh. <laughs> I know it. So it's sort of like we're the only place on the planet that doesn't have some extreme. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you know, isn't that weird? Yeah, it is. So, uh, so we're going to bring a little bit of that peace, love, and tie-dye out to you today as we talk about the elders' relation to BioTouch. Da, 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 da. If there's any elders out there, let us know in the uh, comment section, and you decide what an elder is. Right. <laughs> <laughs> you might be 18 years old and feel like an elder. That's all right. That's right. <laughs> Uh, and if you're in your 70s and you don't think you're an elder, well, that's okay too. But uh, let's get to reality. And that is, no matter what age, we're going to talk about this elder. And the, and the reason uh, I wanted to talk about it was uh, I was sent this uh, to join this Facebook uh, group. And it's called uh, Modern Elders Academy. And they have a moderneldersacademy.org. Very interesting group of people. And uh, one of their purposes that we're going to sort of build on here is, is the following. Society's outdated model of a three-stage life, learn, earn, and retire, taught us that life was a one-tank ride <laughs> where we fuel up with curiosity and counsel in our learn period and burn most of our old school fuel in the earn period. But with increased longevity and accelerated changes in the modern workplace, today many of us are running on fumes and in need of a midlife pit stop. <laughs> Woo. Look out. I like how they call it midlife. So they went I'm, from Elder Academy to a midlife pit stop. <laughs> well, you know, the, I mean, things are, like I said, people are living longer, right? Yes, yep. we, they are living longer, and that's what we want to talk about. One of the first things I'd like to bring up as we talk about different aspects here is Dr. Kenneth Stevenson, who did her research with us. And if you'll notice here on the chart I'm showing you, uh, the basic thing is cortisol dysregulation is a normal thing. That is the uh, midlife pit stop. We're running on fumes is our chronic stress and immune dysregulation. Those uh, two things are part of what happens as we move in our years here on the planet, which create dementia, cardiovascular disease, infections, tumors, mood disorders, obesity. And she showed scientifically and clinically that when you put BioTouch into that chronic stress cycle, you improve the circadian uh, pattern of cortisol release, which improves the quality of life. And that's the main thing we want to talk about. Improves the quality of life. Healthy aging, she called it. I like that. Yeah. Healthy she age. said, you know, as a doctor, she could do all kinds of things with medications and operations right. uh, to extend your life, but she couldn't do anything for the quality of your life. Quality. Yeah. Yep. And she That's found up it to each of us. Yes. Isn't it? And she found BioTouch in, helped us improve the quality of our life. So let's talk a little about that, about how society has looked at elders and how BioTouch gives us a different opportunity. Yeah, you know, um, when she talks about the quality of life, that's that's such a wide um, uh, aspect of our of our experience here because to to really live a quality life is is not just about you know having health and and wealth um, as we're being you know we're recreating those old school thoughts about what life can, can be. And I, and BioTouch is, um, you know, that's the foundation of what it is here to help us with. Because when we have a quality of life, yes, you know, we're living as in a healthy 
environment. We're making choice, we're able to make choices to bring us into that. But I think one of the things that BioTouch lets us do that is so important is it helps us to interact with each other. This, I'm telling you, this is the foundation of all of our quality of life. You know, I have a thought. When one of us prospers, we all prosper. It opens the door. We're, right. we're that connected. And so BioTouch offers all of us, and talk about healthy aging. I mean, when you're able to help another person, I don't care if you're 90 years old, you have contributed to a quality of your life. You're in loving service to another person. So this is a this is a part of of you know the foundation of BioTouch here. It's literally offering us the opportunity in 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 any moment right. to change and to go in another direction that literally expands our experience in a quality living it it increases our health and wealth on, on levels that we're having to now reconfigure right we think about right well and you we talked a lot about how especially in our western society you know our elders are just sort of put over there you know, let's yeah. just scoot them to the side and, yeah. and, uh, you know, we don't have, it's the society is moving so fast, you know, we don't have time for the elders because, you know, then the elders sit back and go, Oh, I don't understand the technology and I don't, you know, and so we're Make just excuses. moving so fast that we, we don't, we have no honoring system for our elders in a Western society. I'm always, yeah. <laughs> and, and you know, what's interesting. I've thought about this my whole life, <laughs> the, 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 lawmakers, the people that, that, you know, uh, bring these regulations and laws into being and hold them are going to be old right. if they're lucky. Right. Well, look at what's happening now. Why aren't you <laughs> having a vision that every single person is going to be uh, elderly? Okay. Right. That means you too. <laughs> right. so. But, but in this society, if you, if, you know, by by the time you're 40 you're like hmm i don't know you're borderline what do you have to offer uh, you're not beautiful you're not this you're not that you know all these criteria and but here here's the one thing i know and i was telling you before there is a formula knowledge plus experience equals wisdom right. this is what many many cultures around the world uh, are so-called, you know, third world. Oh yeah, whatever. They honor their elders because it is time at that stage of your life, you've now achieved certain life's experiences to pass down to those in your family, in your circle, to help them to navigate their own lives in better ways. This right. is a quality of life that the elderly, uh, you know, when I was in Europe, mm -hmm. let me tell you, they get it. They have implemented certain uh, laws and regulations and, and the young people there, whew, they don't even right. have to be told. Well, they it's take in care of their elderly. Most cult, I mean, uh, East Indian yeah. culture, India, you know, that there's these phases and that last phase of your life, the elder life, you are honored for the ability and the opportunity now, once you've done your householder life, to live your spiritual wisdom yes. years. Uh, in, in the Philippines, I remember a woman who was taking care of my mother. You know, they, boy, she just honored my mother. They right. honored their elders and took care of them and did whatever it took to take care of them. Uh, you know, I, I remember once in Hawaii, we were working on this, uh, elder lady, and she was really uh, loved BioTouch. She was a very much holistic healthcare practitioner. And all of a sudden, her daughter got hold of her and started telling her how old she was and started uh, moving her into this community. And I'll tell you, she didn't die within a year. Oh, I mean, it just man. that thought system of, you, you know, we need to put you away in a home and, and you got to got stop going out. And she went from vibrancy to death in, in a year. And so, 
And so BioTouch, what yeah. does BioTouch bring to that old thought system is empowerment, you know, the ability to participate with your family and your loved ones and your community. Well, you know, we, we talk about BioTouch breaks down barriers. This is, this, is a, this is a societal barrier, a mind thought in this society that once you've reached a certain age, you have nothing left. You, you, you know, go sit on that porch. But BioTouch says, are you kidding me? Uh, healthy aging is about serving and a presence within yourself and what you, and it lets us, it gives us an opportunity to give something right. to every single person in your life. I don't care if it's a newborn baby or, or your spouse, it's a, a 90 years old. Right. BioTouch breaks through all of that because as long as you've got those, so let's, let's just, we were talking about this uh, amazing yeah. woman, Rose, Rose right. that, that came to BioTouch for a health work, uh, health workshop. For CE uh, credits. A, yes, to get CE credits. <laughs> she was a massage therapist ago. at 90 years old still. Right, she was 90 <laughs> years old and um, she ended up taking uh, the practitioner training. She was the first practitioner that they hired at Canyon Ranch. Right. I mean, she you know, worked on, she told us that uh, Oprah's feet, and, but she, she was a reflexologist and a massage therapist. Well, at 90 years old, guess what? She wasn't able to do the, the, the work that massage demands of your body, right? So she found BioTouch and she told me, oh my gosh, BioTouch lets me still help other people in a very powerful way with their stress and pain, but it doesn't tax my body. What a gift this is for me. And here we go. Rose at 90 years old could reach out with those two fingers right. and help another person and be totally, uh, you know, available. It's accessible and doable for her. So she, for me, is our poster right. child for the elderly, having, still having something to give. To give. And, and what a wonderful lesson for our families, you know, yes. to have grandma or grandpa or great grandpa. Grandma. We have Jenny on with us now. She's got great grandkids, you know, know to be able to share with your, your grandchildren and even more important. Imagine saying to your grandchild, especially if they're in their, you know, more formative years, like teenagers and stuff like that, and they don't want anything to do with anybody, to, to go to them and say, you know, grandma needs you. You're going to have that opportunity real soon here, <laughs> going to live yeah. with your grandkids, you know, and, yeah. and to be able to say to them, you know, grandma needs your help. You know, let me show you what you can do to help me with my little stress or my eyes, you know, I'm or I've got to. an allergy. <laughs> yes. And I'm telling you, even though they might just go, eh, 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 they inside, internally will feel so powerful, so empowered, so much love because they can help grandma. Right. I, the thought of it just blows me away. I know. You know, that's so interesting that you just say that because I thought just last week, oh my gosh, I'm going to get my granddaughter. I'm going to teach her how to do this and this, and I'm going to have her. While I'm still with them, I'm going to have her start doing BioTouch with me on a regular basis. Right. I deserve it, and she deserves to be able to have this to, to yeah. help somebody with. And, and the beautiful thing, you know, when you look at, at like your granddaughter, you know, they might be doing what we would consider as in our elder years. My God, what are they doing? You know, the way they look and dress, you know, and the man and, you know. Now yeah. the, the genes all have to have a million holes in it. Oh, Jesus God. Christ, back in Shredding. the 60s, that was what all we wore. <laughs> now it costs you a, 150 bucks for a pair of those jeans. <laughs> so, so anyhow, I mean, the beauty is, you know, no matter what the uh, other generation is into, BioTouch will, it does, it equalizes the playing field. It just says, you know, we're just human beings here on the planet. We're just here to love one another. We're here to help one another, make it through this, whatever this life is, 
and it just bridges the gaps between generations. It's yeah. just incredible. We, we have to get over this. Every time you label somebody with a number, right? You you are limiting their potential to love and to serve, and to and their quality of life. Stop it, because <laughs> I got to tell you, as an elder, my I feel like my life is just starting. I've got so much to give and so much, and BioTouch is such a huge part of that. Are you kidding me? Huh. Right, there you nope. go. Huh. Not doing it. And that's why this group, this elder group calls it midlife pit stop. <laughs> you know, yeah, another it. thing on that, that website they talk about is you're not allowed to uh, have ageism. Yes. <laughs> ageism. I'm like, well, there's Good. another ism. Ageism. There's another ism. <laughs> All of us elders are saying, hey, don't put us into a box, God dang yeah. it. <laughs> Breathe. I mean, look at you. You're Look at the work you're doing. You're old. <laughs> yeah. I am old. You know something? What's interesting, when I was really young, I looked forward to getting old. You know, I don't mind being called old. I, I always thought, you know something? That's a great period of life, I think. And sure you know, enough, it has been the best of my life. There, there's a uh, song by John Denver, and he says in there, it turns me on to think of getting old. <laughs> there <laughs> we go, that. folks. So if you want to be turned on, <laughs> think of getting old. <laughs> Practice biotouch. <laughs> and we'll all just be happy. <laughs> yeah, happy, healthy, and loved. That's right. And you know something? All it can take, you know, if, if you're an elder, get your grandkids do a Zoom even with them if you're if you are a younger generation and you've got parents or grandparents. Just learn this greeting. You just take the two fingers of your dominant hand. Real simple. We're not even going to show the video. Right. And you take those two fingers. And if you'll feel on your breastbone, feel that there, and it falls in, at the end of it, gets soft. You know, just above the tummy there. And you take those two fingers of the dominant hand and you hold lightly at the bottom of that breastbone in the soft tissue for six to eight seconds. Very light, just like a butterfly. Now, even if you're listening to this on a podcast, you should be able to find that point. And you hold that six to eight seconds, and then you take that same dominant hand, and if you'll feel behind your neck, go down your neck, down, 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 and a big bone pops out. Lean your head forward, your big bone will pop out. Go to the left of that, about an inch to an inch and a half with those same two fingers Hold it lightly, six to eight seconds, and boom, you've made a connection with another human being at all kinds of levels, <laughs> things we can't even prove. That we, we have no proof about the connection that's being made on a deep, deep level between human beings. But we're going to teach it, and one of the ways we're going to teach it is this Thursday with our very own lovely Amy Glog, who's gone through her own eating disorder problems. And she's going to share with her her experiences and a little about the situation. And then we're going to teach you the points on how to address eating disorders. And that can be anything from anorexia, bulimia, or any other disorder that you might have in relation to eating. What and a that's great, just, What a great condition workshop. I'm yeah. really looking forward to this. And we've had a lot of people sign up uh, who want CE credits. So if you want CE Wonderful. credits... Um, just uh, go to our website. If you're a massage therapist, doula, or a nurse, you can get CE credits for that. Uh, and uh, then on Saturday, that's Thursday at 6 p.m., just live streaming on Zoom. And on Saturday, we have our regular practitioner training, uh, eight CE credits for a massage therapist there. Uh, that's from 9 to 4.30, and we hope you'll join us for that. Just go to our website or use that QR code that takes you right to the sign-up page. And those are really fun uh, uh, seven-hour uh, teachings. They just whiz yep. by. They so, do, don't they? Yep. yep. And uh, I'm just going to whiz by. It might be my prostate condition, but whatever. <laughs> <laughs> make so, your pit stop. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, make my pit stop. We, we had fun on this one. Us elders <laughs> over here enjoyed sharing BioTouch with you. We hope you'll practice it. Take care, Bev. Take care, Paul. Have a great day, everybody. Bye. Bye. <laughs>
by the weather But it doesn't hurt that much After I feel your loving touch And we spend some time together You take my pain away Each and every day You're an angel from heaven on high Your butterfly touch Helps me heal so much And I get better as time goes by You take my pain away 